Hello, Facebook Live. Hello, hello, hello. It is Deshaun Antoinette Booker, your maximizing coach. I hope that you are joining me this evening. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Monday. Beautiful, beautiful Monday. Hello, Elizabeth. Thank you for joining me all the way from the East Coast. Thank you so very, very much. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, Darrell. Thank you for joining me this evening. <clears throat> Excuse my voice. Whew. I'm just a little, little exhausted here with all the preparations for Friday's launch. So I'm so excited. Listen, we're going to do some inviting some people, okay? Let's invite some others. Hello, Michael Baylock. Thank you for joining me this evening. Good evening, everyone. I'm so excited that you are in the building with me today as we continue on our journey of setting the intentions for the official launch party for maximizing your magnificence. So I am just going to invite a few people today, this evening, as we begin to set the intention for tonight. I uh, hope that your day was well. Hope that all went well for you today and that you did everything you wanted to do and that you're continuing to do everything you want to do on this beautiful um, May 15th. Today is actually my mother's birthday, Miss Joyce Ferguson. So we wish her, as she celebrates in heaven, a happy birthday today, Mommy. We love you. God bless you. We are so excited um, to be sharing the official launching of Maximizing Your Magnificence as I also celebrate my mom's birthday this week. So that's pretty cool, right? Pretty exciting. So listen, you know, I always like to just invite a couple of people to join in with us on the celebration this evening. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um, All righty. There we go. There we go. Hello, Miss Kia. Thank you for joining me, girl. Nakia, are you going to be in the building on this Friday? I hope so. I hope so. I hope so. I hope so. Yes, 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 yes. Um, invite Kia to be, no. Okay. I see what they're asking me. Some new things on this Facebook Live. Listen, I'm going to jump right into it. I'm going to jump right into it. Um, okay. I am Deshaun Antoinette Booker, your maximizing coach, and I am in the awesome ministry of working with people to do three things, to get intentional with their lives, to live and work with integrity, and to manifest increase in every area of their life so that we are truly having an abundance, right, of consciousness and that we are awakened to who we are and what we are supposed to do on this earth. Our destiny. We become co-creators with that, right? So, oh, okay, Miss Kid. So you can't come. Listen, you may have to come do the little prom champagne party, and you head on over to the marina. Kia, you have to do that. You don't want to miss it. Come on now. Come on. It's gonna be so so grand. So, I have been coming to you. And I have been giving you my intentions on why I am having the official launch party for maximizing your magnificence. And so I am doing this all the way until this Thursday, right? So I'm so, so excited to be able to share my intentions with you and then also be able and, and just really deposit some streams of consciousness into you. Okay, so I'm always looking for things to actually be a teaching tool, a teaching tool, if you will. So I hope you had a wonderful day today and I hope that your evening is going wonderful wherever you are, East Coast, West Coast, right? Wherever you are. So let's jump right into it. Today, I set the intention to simplify. I set the intention to simplify. So what do I mean by that? I'm glad you asked. I want to share with you. Oftentimes, we are always caught up in an overflow of thoughts, of ideas, of desires and goals and dreams. And we are often just running this race to get to the end 
but we're not actually taking the time to allow ourselves to flow in simplicity, to really begin to just be in the process of it all. We want to figure it out. We want to make certain that we know what's going to happen before it happens. We want to make sure that we're not going to be caught off guard because we don't want to feel in any way let down, rejected, and just not prepared. So we are always as humans wanting to gather everything so that we have it right here and then I could give it from this place. I'm now serving from a place of control, self-assurance, maybe even pride, ego. Well, we're going to toss all that aside today. We want to set the intention that we are living in a place of simplicity. Simplicity. And what does that mean? I'll tell you what that means. I'm glad you asked. I want to offer this to you. There are many times in our lives where we need to sit still and be quiet. Where we need to allow the flow of divine order to take its natural course in our life. Sometimes we're not going to like the way that looks. We're not going to like the way it feels. We're not going to like the way that it, it smells, right? When it's just, we're just not going to like it. But when we come to a place, and I'm always talking about surrender, when we come to a place of sweet surrender, we allow the process of simplicity to show up and serve us. We allow the process of simplicity to show up and serve us. That is super duper amazing. I want to let you in on just a little secret. Sometimes we can find the greatest opportunities, the greatest expectations come out of simply being simple. And so on Friday, May 19th, I am going to share with you what simplicity looks like in the grand scheme of things. Yes, we are celebrating the official launching of Maximizing Your Magnificence, which is my speaking, coaching, and training company. And we're going to simply set the atmosphere of creating possibilities. But we're also going to be aware of doing that in an atmosphere and space of simplicity. Of simplicity. I am going to allow each and every person that is present to simply experience being still, quiet, and surrendering to simplicity. You know, we want to let go sometimes so that more can come in. You know, we always say these type of things right around the end of the year. What are we going to do for our New Year's resolution? Sometimes we have these wonderful rituals at the end of the year where we will, let's say, clean out our closet, right? We wash all of our clothes. We, we, we begin to go and see what clothes we can donate because why? We are allowing a new season to come in a new freshness to come into our lives, right? Hello, Daryl. Thanks for joining the conversation. And so we are allowing a new season of freshness to come in. All of the time, this happens for us at the end of the year. Oh, we're going to allow the newness and the brightness and all these great things to come in. So we are allowing ourselves to release those things of the, of the previous year. So that our new year is bold, is bountiful, is full of life, is vibrant. This is the same principle of being simple in the things that we do in our lives. So this is what I want you to know this evening. I want you to know that the more that we let go so that there's room enough for something better to come in, we are simplifying. We want to remain guarded, guided, and protected so that we are always aligned to our highest potential. Our highest potential. Yes, you want to keep yourself guarded, guided, and protected. And you're always in alignment with your highest potential. 
And the way that we do that is that we must trust and remain open to receive from expected and unexpected sources. That's then when we simplify. We're not going to always be able to identify how our blessings, how the opportunities are going to show up for us. Right? Right? So let's remain open and trust that there are expected and unexpected sources that are available to us. That is when we begin to simplify. So I want you to join me and a host of other beautiful human beings on this planet that will help celebrate the official launching of Maximizing Your Magnificence. We are going to simplify so that we're not just always in the hustle and bustle of things. That's not what we're going to do. We are going to literally be full of allowing the simplicity of life to show up so that we surrender to it. We don't want to continue to keep missing things, right? Because we're here and there and trying to bring it all in. Let's just simplify. When I was thinking about the launch party, when I was thinking about doing the launch party, hey, Bob, thank you for joining the conversation. When I was thinking about doing the launch party, I had all of these ideas in my head. And some of them, hmm, I was really moving towards talking myself out of it. Oh, I'll wait until. Oh, maybe it's not the right time. See, there was no simplifying there. There was just all of this hustle and bustle. All this hustle and bustle. And so I decided that the simplest thing that I can give to others is to share the simplicity of serving from a great platform. There is simplicity in that. Simply serving from a platform and depositing into others. So, I encourage you to do the same. I encourage you to do the same. Embark on your new way of thinking, believing, and being by simply surrendering to a space of simplicity. I want you to Please join me on this Friday. Invite your friends. If you haven't already, get your RSVP uh, invite into me, your VIP ticket. Go ahead. Everything is right here on this Facebook Live post. You want to RSVP to MaximizeMagnificence at gmail.com or also give me a call at the number where we're taking our reservations, which is 310-291. 8519. Hello, Chris. Thanks for joining the conversation. I know I'm going to see Chris on Friday. He's already got his VIP ticket. He's in the building. He's in the building. So, again, join us this Friday where we are going to have a fabulous time. Hello, Daryl Bell. Thanks for joining the conversation. Listen, join us this Friday. We are going to maximize our magnificence from a space of simplicity. We are going to have a grand celebration. Yes, yes, we are. Yes, right, Chris? Yep, 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 yep. So I am so delighted. Share this video. Share the video. And I'm coming to you tomorrow with my next intention of what we're going to set in motion the night of Friday, May 19th. I'm so excited to see you. I love to support and serve you. So again, remember that I want you to allow things to come out of your life so that new things can come in. We cannot put new wine in old wine skin. It will burst. It will burst. So with that, remember, as I always say, life happens for us and not to us. God bless you. Have a wonderful, wonderful. Oh, Daryl, it's your first time. Thank you for joining the conversation, Daryl. I'm glad you're a part of this conversation. So as I was saying, have a good evening. Thank you for joining us. Share the video, you all. And I want to see you this Friday. If you are in Los Angeles, listen, if you are not in Los Angeles, you need to get your airplane ticket. You need to get out here because we are going to have a grand time celebrating and celebrating with one another and sharing our visions at the official launch party of Maximizing Your Magnificence. I love you. God bless you. Have a good evening. And as always, smooches 
and deuces. Good night.